the top class hotel, the Tooting Glen Hotel in Hampshire, uh, just sitting in the grounds as uh, 12 of our chefs are in the kitchen working away and seeing new ideas and new tricks on how to present food to our residents. It's been really nice today. It's been really, I've, I've jammed a lot of uh, core uh, techniques in today and I think what's really nice is getting to know them and getting to know what they like. It's really funny you get 12 people and they all when they first walk through the door they're really nervous and the first thing as a tutor is like get them all nice and relaxed first and then trying to see what makes them tick. There are chefs already so they can cook food this is giving them new ideas on how to cook it and fine-tuning and how to present it to the residents so that we're giving the residents the best cooked well presented food as possible. I've never worked with a care home company before and what's been really exciting is to see the level of the cooking that's required now uh, for the care homes, you know, not just being like creative but looking down the nutrition side as well. And what's, what I find fantastic about today is having a great, great group of chefs and then trying to inspire them. It's sometimes really hard as a teacher to show somebody how to make a bolognese interesting but it's looking at the tips and how to get ahead and the little tips and the twist that you can create on that dish for the little wow factor. Keeping in mind as well, looking at something fresh, clean and also looking at the, in, the, in the care homes. Um, it's a total and new education for me, knowing about certain people in the care homes have got to have more fat, they've got to be careful of the sugar and the dietary side of things. So again, it's looking at a really well balanced menu, colourful and bright, and, and then showing the chefs then how to deal with their environment, the, the equipment, the pans that they've got, the time issues they've got, and sometimes the budget. But what's really nice about the care home here is a lot of you know, people say, oh, it's on a shoestring, everything's got to be done made for a pound. But it's really nice working with a company who can then spend a little bit more money, a little bit more time having these wonderful lessons to then show the chefs how you can create something from nothing and really then working on those core ingredients and then core values and make something really, really fantastic. He's, he's made them so welcome, it, it's been a real laugh. I mean, we've had some fun, he's really he's made them all of these, because some of them were the younger ones, were a little shy and a little, felt a little anxious or intimidated about coming to this fine place. But uh, he put them at ease within the first half an hour and they've really got on well with them. And their comments have been when I came to see them at their break was that this has been a great day. I found today really, really beneficial. Um, it's definitely stuff that we can take back to the home. Um, we've been shown different techniques and different styles of stuff. So I think um, stuff especially that I think the residents would enjoy. I really, really enjoyed the course. It was really nice that they'd done something for the chefs. Um, makes me inspired to do a lot more for the residents. And I really enjoyed it and I'd love to do it again. What we're trying to do, if we can get a core basic standard throughout the whole group, and then you can look out at some of your ones who want to be a bit more creative because they can then communicate more with the guests and the people in the care homes and make it more of an experience for them as well, given the whole package as a family. <laughs>